Hey everybody, this is Dead Winter Dead with another Battlefield 4 video for you. Today we are taking a look at one of my pet peeves again. Now, I know you guys are probably sick of hearing this, but it just annoys the ever-living crap out of me as a support player. I'm running the Recon class with a pump-action shotgun. I'm running tugs and motion balls. And my... Uh, the tactics here is that I will put the tugs down on the edge of the battlefield, you know, the, uh, the sharp end of the spear, as you will, uh, so that my friendly players can see the enemy locations as the tugs pings their location. Then I will throw sensor balls further into the combat area to sort of, quote-unquote, extend the tugs range so that all of my friendly players around me can see the not only the localized enemy activity but the extended enemy activity very very uh, useful tactic if you're gonna play recon but you run out of motion balls pretty quick you also run out, run out of tugs now <clears throat> I had been spamming Q to this support player right here and um, my character in game gives the little audible you know request ammo request ammo I need ammo I need rounds you know however many uh, cues there are in the game and he refused to drop ammo now the little glowing uh, ammo symbol above his head indicates that he is carrying ammo whether it's the ammo pouch or the ammo box remains to be seen but it takes no time at all it literally t it literally takes a second to drop ammo and as you can see he had c4 and I just dropped the ammo box because I picked his kit up Drop ammo, drop ammo, drop ammo. If you're going to be a support player, drop ammo. That is your job. That is probably your the most important job you can have on the battlefield to help out friendly players is give them ammunition. Now, as you saw in that clip, unfortunately, I had to shoot that guy. And even though I wasn't doing any damage to him, you know, usually when someone gets kind of pinged in the in the back of the head, it obscures their vision and it shakes their screen a little bit. So basically, I mean, that's the only way I can get his attention. That's basically the the video game digital way of tapping someone on the shoulder. As you can see, I have to do it again. Now, in this case, it might have been a little bit a little bit selfish, but he was hiding behind cover, and we were attacking enemies that were trying to come in on the snow lane. This is Operation Locker, if you can't already tell. Um, but again, it only takes, it only takes a quick second. I believe the default button on the PC, on the PC is the number four key. And if any of you, any of you are, um, familiar with, you know, with the, uh, with the keyboard layout, the four key isn't too far away. It's maybe like half an inch, maybe three quarters of an inch away from the W key, which is your forward key. So your index finger should be able to switch very, very quickly over to the four key, drop that ammo box, and then just forget about it. Again, this is a third time I'm trying to request ammo. And as you can see, these guys are stuck in the stairwell. Uh, we have a bunch of guys in the stairwell, and I'm, I'm asking for ammo so that I can, you know, drop those, uh, drop those motion balls so we can get a bead on the enemy. So, I don't know, guys. Uh, just drop ammo if you're a support player. Anyway, <laughs> my name is Dead Winter Dead. Thanks for watching.